protein manufacturing happens in body cells. Here is our nucleus and here is the cell membrane. What's inside the nucleus? In the nucleus there are 23 pairs of chromosomes. These are represented as socks. First we need our chromosome. Inside the chromosome is a string of DNA. This brings us to stage one, transcription. <laughs> Here's a string of DNA. Let's take a closer look. DNA is structured in a double helix. The double helix structure is connected together by weak hydrogen bonds. The two strands are made up of sugars and phosphates. The strands are connected by complementary base pairs. Thymine, adenine, cytosine and guanine. Here is our enzyme, RNA polymerase. He is used to break the hydrogen bonds which separates the strands. A single strand is produced by reading one side of the separated DNA and matching it up with its complementary base pairs. This strand is called mRNA, messenger RNA. Why is this strand different to this strand? Uracil replaces thymine as adenine's complementary base pair. This all happens in the nucleus. Welcome to the cytoplasm. In the cytoplasm, the mRNA strand attaches to a ribosome. We have now finished stage one of protein synthesis. This leads us on to stage two, translation. <laughs> <laughs>